Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How many electoral votes does Pennsylvania have? In the United States, the Electoral College plays a pivotal role in the presidential election process. It is a unique system that determines the outcome of the presidential elections, not by popular vote, but through electoral votes. Each state, along with the District of Columbia, is allocated a certain number of electoral votes, which is directly related to its representation in Congress. This means the total number of electoral votes a state has is the sum of its senators and representatives in Congress. Pennsylvania, known for its significant historical contributions and as a key battleground state in elections, holds a notable position in the Electoral College. The state's number of representatives in the House is subject to change every 10 years, following the national census, which may also alter its electoral votes. Senators, however, remain constant at two for every state, ensuring equal representation in the Senate. The allocation of electoral votes is crucial as it influences campaign strategies, with candidates focusing on states with higher electoral votes. Pennsylvania's position has made it a focal point in recent elections, drawing considerable attention from presidential candidates. The exact number of electoral votes Pennsylvania has can be understood by considering its congressional representation. As of the latest apportionment, Pennsylvania's voice in the Electoral College is determined by its current number of representatives, plus its two senators. Understanding the distribution and significance of electoral votes across states like Pennsylvania is essential for grasping the mechanics of the U.S. presidential election system. This system underscores the importance of every state, especially those with a higher number of electoral votes, in the path to securing the presidency. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.